Hello YouTube, another fellow stackers. Midwest Stacker here with another unboxing. So let's dive into this one. This is another US Mint order. And like I said, I have been hoarding boxes for what feels like a month now. Uh, just trying to uh, think about how I wanted to set my cameras up and my recording and my sound. And this is the shitty setup that I have right now. And uh, yeah, this is what I'm going with. So what do we have in here? Ah, yes. As you can see, this has been in our property for quite some time. And just, uh, just like I said, I just started unboxing this. So let's take a look. Whew. What did we pay for this? 175 and change, somewhere in there. This one is not going to get graded. Um, I'm going to keep it in its set just like it is. Here's the COA if you'd like to read it. Could pause the video if I can get it even in line for you guys. Sorry, I'm working with a new camera setup, so not quite uh, the best at this, but there you go. I gotta say, these are beautiful. Wow. I almost do want to take them out and get them graded. These are just stunning. Look at those. Now I have to say, I have a tube, but I haven't opened it yet. There'll probably be an unboxing with it, obviously, at some point. I this is my first time I'm taking a look at this. So sorry for my my pause and speaking here. I've got to say maybe it's just because it's this reverse proof. I like this. This to me is classic and it'll no, never go out of style, but this to me feels like our money. Bunch of dead presidents, bunch of old dudes on uh, on our currency, no really showy, it's not sexy, it's just, it's a, it's classic, right? This is a classic feel to a classic coin. The reverse proof's really nice. This, though, gives it some character. Gives it a little extra pizzazz, a little extra, you know, oomph behind it. You know, I'm, I'm glad they kept the classic design on the front. I'm guessing that might change in, you know, another 10 years or so. But, you know, it looks like we're making some progress. The details are super nice. Quality is really good. I, I am... I am very happy with these coins. They they did a phenomenal job. Now, hmm. I'm a collector, right? I'm not a stacker. I'm a stacker too. But at the end of the day, I am a collector. I think these are going to hold their value. This set is going to hold its value. I hope. So, whew. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just taking away how, how great those look. What are your thoughts? Do you like these? Do you like the new background? Do you like the reverse proof design they did here? Do you like the two coin set? Do you think the price was fair? Leave a comment below. Let me know if you think that price was fair for what was 175, I think, for two ounces of silver at the end of the day. What do you think? Is that a fair price for what this is? I don't know. I think it is. Well, maybe. We'll see what the, the future holds. The black on black embossed. It's kind of nice, too. I don't know. I feel like the U.S. Mint's packaging could maybe get a slight upgrade. This is pretty generic. But, you know... It's the US Mint, what do you expect? You know, if this was something from the Perth Mint, I would probably be better displayed, right? 
a little bit more advanced in their products and offerings and packaging. I don't know. It's not bad. I like it for a collector. This is uh, going in my, my collection set, not my stacking set. And we'll, uh, we'll go from there. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed this quick unboxing video. I hope it's... Uh, Hope you guys got yours if you're looking into getting one of these. I only bought one. I think Household Limit was actually one, so uh, nothing I can do to flip or make extra little money to pay for this one, so I'm happy with it. All right, this is Nubo Stacker saying, see you when I see you. Peace.